Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. Regular viewers will know I review many photographic, video and audio related products. Well today we're taking a look at a camera bag, which is really not very exciting I know, but it's only a quick look. Um, I recently reviewed the Billingham Hadley Small and it's a great bag. I use it a lot. It's, you know, it takes two cameras, a uh, protective flap on the top, two pouches, etc, etc. Um, but that is great if I'm going out with Mandy and there's two of us taking photographs, I put the two cameras in there, job's done, we're ready to go. If I'm going out on my own or I'm going out with my brother but only taking one camera, I wanted something even smaller. So I wanted to keep a Billingham because I love Billingham bags. So. I purchased a Billingham Digital, which is basically this uh, bag here. Um, it's a lot smaller, well, it's about half the size of the, well, give or take, not quite half the size of the Hadley Small. It's only got the one big pouch, which is, which is you know, absolutely all. It's still got the protective padded uh, top, and I really like that because a lot of these cameras don't have protection for the screens. so. Basically in here, you can fit the one body and I've got quite a large body in here. I've got the Fujifilm X-H1 and it will take a big lens on the body because it's a deep, it's a really deep bag. So I've got the one body and then I've got in this little corner pouch here, I've got a, an additional lens and it just happens to be the 18 to 55. I've actually put telephoto lenses in there, absolutely fine. So. You know, it comes with this, uh, I think it comes with two petitioners. I've taken one out, I've only got the one. Really nice padding, as you would expect from Billingham. Billingham make, you know, the most amazing bags. They're not cheap by any means, but they really are work very, very well made. The stitching, oh, everything about a Billingham bag uh, reeks of quality, and it really does. You'll never be disappointed with a Billingham bag. Um, and as I say, that fits in there nice and neatly. And there you have a really good, you know, good bag. It's got brass, uh, brass fittings on the bag. Um, and it's got a pouch in the front here for putting all your odds and ends, you know, spare batteries, SD card, wallet, you know, um, whatever you want to put in the front there. And that's basically the bag. Um, it's made of can canvas. Uh, what do b &H say about it? They say, um, made of storm blocker dual laminate waterproof canvas so there we go <laughs> basically a canvas bag um i love it it's got these brass fittings nice clip on the front there that just clips on and you know it's a smart bag to carry around so there we go that's the billingham digital very compact really smart bag good very good quality strap very comfortable uh, to have over your shoulder, um, yeah, absolutely delighted with it. I've also got a um, Manfrotto bag, which I'm going to talk about at another point, but this is also um, a very nice bag. Um, it's quite a bit bigger, and that takes two cameras, just a wee bit bigger than the Billingham. So um, I'll go through that another day. But um, there we go, that's the Billingham Digital. They do it in various colours. I've got it in this light beige colour, um, just well, I weren't really bothered what colour it came in, uh, it's just how it came. So um, there we go, that's the Billingham Digital, suits all my Fuji cameras, absolutely no problem at all. And that's my biggest Fuji, it won't fit in there with a battery grip on, well it probably would if, no it wouldn't, no. Um, but you know, again I could always put a there we go, take out that lens and I could put, this is the um, X, uh, X Pro 2 with a lens on. That would fit down there, possibly. I don't know if that will still fit in there. No, no, so yeah, it's not really a two bodied bag. That, that's too big, but yeah, one body, one lens and you definitely Good to go. There we go. Ha uh, the Billingham Digital. Thank you so much for watching my channel. That was a quick one. And 
Uh, I hope you stay tuned for further reviews that I do. Uh, always check into the channel. I'm always updating uh, regular product reviews. Um, hopefully uh, in 2019, I'll be doing more tutorials. Um, but there we go. That's the uh, Billingham Digital. Hope you enjoy my channel. Please subscribe if you haven't already done so and hit the like button if you uh, like this video and tell all your friends. Really appreciate it. I do buy everything that you see. I don't get sent stuff. I don't get given stuff. So, um, you know, it, I do like to see the likes and the um, subscriptions. It helps me grow the channel. So thanks very much and look forward to the next one. See you soon. Bye. <laughs>